Hello, in this video I'll cover new and updated functions of breakers in power system modeling software EAPSM 4.1 such as protection tracking, protection copying and breaker connection types. Protection tracking In version 4.1 protection tracking has been updated. It is much simpler to see which breakers have tripped in certain situations. Users may now analyze multiple situations at once. For a particular example, let's see which protection strip if we have a short circuit at two different bus bars. To do so, use the drop down menu Optimize Protection Tracking. Choose the tracking mode. It is also possible to use two other tracking modes Power Flows and Motor Starts. Select bus bars in which short circuits occurred. Event times will be displayed on the left side of the window. Short circuit buses, breakers, protections and trip time will be displayed on the right. Selecting a fault bus in the list will highlight elements which have tripped during the selected fault. Breaker connection types. In this version it is also possible to configure breaker connection types. This can be done by double-clicking on a breaker, clicking on tab Equipment and Breaker Connections. There are multiple choices on how to connect a breaker. It can be put in a cage or connected through disconnectors, which may be on the either side of the element. Grounding switches can be implemented near the disconnector as well. Breaker graphics will change accordingly. If there is a need to change the graphic of a disconnector, it may be done in Graphic Settings tab. Protection Copying Copying breaker protections is a new feature that is useful when building a scheme. In a matter of seconds, user may copy breaker protections and their parameters to another breaker. To proceed, configure the protection, click on the breaker and drag it over to another breaker. Release the mouse and click OK. We can see that the protection and its parameters are the same as the other breakers. For more information, visit our site. Thanks for watching.